I'm Stuart Munro, Patent and Medical Managing Director. Freemask is a product that's been designed in a short space of time in response to the current COVID-19 situation globally, but with a thought to future pathogenic threats. We're filming here in central London this afternoon where we'll see quite clearly uh, masks disposed of in the street lying about are not very environmentally friendly because they're single-use devices. Free mask is a better environmental solution because it's a reusable single personal device rather than a single-use device. A solution that's made from TPE, which is environmentally friendly and 100% recyclable and designed for lifetime use of the individual. Very much like any product, and uh, particularly one that's been developed in such a short space of time, has had to compromise to get the best possible overall solution in place as quickly as possible. The trade-off has been kind of the appearance, it's not the most elegant design. What we can do is improve that through time, we believe. However, if this was a case of COVID-19 not being COVID-19, but H1N1, which was the flu that struck in 1918, and wiped out around 50 million people globally with an average age of 28 years old. Do you think people would be worried about how they look? Everybody would want one of these masks right now. My name's Jamie Munro and I'm the sales manager for Pentland Medical in the UK. The very mask is a full face mask designed to protect the nose, the mouth and the eyes, which are all three points of entry for viral transmission. The idea of the Viri mask is to provide a much better solution than is currently available, uh, protecting up to 99.9% .9 particles down to 0.1 micron, with a much better filtration rate than, than commonly used masks. Masks used by frontline healthcare workers and even members of the general public, uh, they don't provide adequate protection. We'll try and demonstrate this against the N95 mask by a, a vape test. We're actually getting a filter here it's filtering out 99.8% of any pathogen threats. Not only that, we're actually then only breathing that air out through the same filter, which is effectively then breathing out clean air, and that reduces the risk to, to anybody in the, the vicinity. So, Ross is now weighing an N95, and he'll do the, exactly the same test, and let's see what happens. As you can see, um, there's no real good sealed fit, which would demonstrate that you don't actually have the maximum protection. There's no mask that fits absolutely everybody. I was recently at a, an NHS hospital where one particular mask that, that had the best results still only managed to fit 60% of the staff. With the very mask, uh, we've tried to address the, the fitting. There's so many different shapes and sizes of face. It's very difficult to get a one size fits all mask. But this is something we are looking to address in the longer term with Ferry Mask with uh, increased sizing options. You've just seen the vape test uh, and that shows you the level of protection that you're getting from a lot of these devices that are out there at the moment. There is also high level respirator masks. They're very expensive and they're impractical for everybody. We're aiming Ferry Mask to be cost effective as well as environmentally friendly and offer the best protection possible. 